We move on now to the toxic train wreck in the nation's capital. The cargo train jumping the tracks early this morning, up to 14 cars derailed and at least two of them leaking dangerous chemicals. Emergency teams now trying to contain those leaks. ABC's Gloria Riviera on the scene. Tonight, 14 rail cars, some packed with hazardous chemicals, scattered across the tracks after a major derailment in Washington, D.C. It was 6.40 a.m. when the train, three locomotives, and 175 rail cars jumped the track less than three miles from the U.S. Capitol building. The train has split. Looks like the train has come apart. And I'm looking at one train that's leaking a chemical. The accident jolting nearby residents. They said it was a leak and I didn't know if it was something that could be harmful to me, my neighbors, the environment. Another tweeting, I wake up to a boom and sirens. I find out a hazmat train derailed with sodium hydroxide. It is a chemical similar to bleach or, uh, or Drano. Sodium hydroxide, a dangerous chemical if it touches the skin. Another car leaked ethanol, a flammable liquid. First responders stopping the leaks within hours. Tonight, investigators are still working to figure out what caused the derailment. Officials say they have tested both the air and the water quality in this area, and both are safe. Tom? Gloria, thank you.